Emilio Kuntoye, President Bola Ametinubu is back in Nigeria after attending the 37th session of the African Union Summit in Addis Ababa. And this year's AU Summit is first for President, uh, President Tinubu since he assumed office on the 29th of May this year. During the summit, he held bilateral meetings with the Prime Minister of Ethiopia and the President of Brazil where they discussed issues of mutual cooperation as well as development. And in his address to the African Union Summit, he declared that Nigeria was ready to host the African Central Bank expected to commence in 2028. The President also announced that ECOWAS is ready to dialogue with Niger, Burkina Faso and Mali uh, and Guinea rather um, towards the restoration of democracy in those countries. Well, last week, the president met with state governors over rising costs of food and inflation and top on the agenda at that meeting, which held at the council chambers of the presidential villa Abuja, is the current food crisis and how the federal government will partner with subnationals to improve the cost of living. After extensive deliberations, the president and governors agreed to work together to solve the problems and tackle the economic pressure being faced by the citizens. Uh, let's take a look now at some of the key takeaways from um, that particular meeting last week. Um, uh, it was resolved that there is a need to address insecurity affecting farming and food production by recruiting more police personnel to strengthen the force and put in place a mechanism that will engender state police instead of the vigilantes that are being used in some states. He also charged the governors to strengthen their forest rangers and arm them to keep all the forests uh, safe from criminals. There's also the need to increase collaboration between state and federal government to engender f local food production, with the president advising against the idea of food importation and price control. The president directed the Inspector General of Police, the National Security Advisor and the DSS to monitor warehouses hardened food items across the country. He also charged the governors to pay attention to livestock development. President Buhari pleaded with governors to ensure that all salary arrears and gratuities are paid to workers and pensioners, respectively, as a way to put some money into the hands of the people since states are now getting more monthly revenue allocation. He told the governors precisely to spend the money, don't spend the people. He also did ask them to create more economic opportunities for the youths to keep them productively engaged. Now let's bring you an excerpt from the president's speech in Adib Ababa over the weekend. The change to create an era of trust and accord. We are doing everything possible, front door, back door diplomacy, to really bring peace and stability and democratic governance to West Africa.